Welcome to the Hunter Report, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Beauty Dish, which is a classic light modifier. The flash goes in right here, and then it bounces off this piece of metal. It does a second bounce onto the internals of the dish, finally going out to the subject. And it provides a very distinct look and feel that really no other modifier provides. For example, the snoot or the softbox, which I'm using to illuminate the video right here can also be used for a flash. I have examined three different beauty dishes in this video. This one here, which is your classic metal beauty dish, and then I've compared it to collapsible beauty dishes. And as you can see, I nearly poked my eye out with some of them. And I'm gonna come to the conclusion that all collapsible beauty dishes are inferior, okay? I don't believe that they are designed to last. I think there's too many moving parts and I think you're trying to accomplish too much. That said, with more research and development, I believe a good beauty dish can be created that is collapsible. But this baby right here, I'd like to think saves me time. Now, you do suffer in one area, which is if you wanna transport it, say to a wedding or to an event, it is harder to transport, but I would recommend keeping the box that it came with for transportation and just putting a little handle on the box if you have to do that. Now let's talk about the myth of the collapsible beauty dish. This is a product here by Photix, and parts of it are constructed well. I mean, this, these joints here are constructed well, and this is constructed well, but this is literally how I got this product right out of the box. See that right there? That rod right there came out and it's because of this screw right here. So parts of it are constructed well and parts of it are not and, and a chain is only as strong as its weakest link and, and these little divots or whatever are just not going to last any more than one or two uses. And so because of that, I'm going to take full advantage of my 30-day return policy and, and return this. So now that we've explored the collapsible beauty dishes, you see, saw me almost get my eye poked out, let's go ahead and just do some shoots with your classic metal beauty dish right here. And let's get started. So I have my flash right here and it's really just as easy as clicking it into place, just like that. My flash stays here. Most beauty dishes, including the one in the description below, have adapters for almost any flash imaginable, from a simple speed light to a more fancy pro photo or any other flash that you may own. All right, I've been fiddling around with the uh, ISO and the aperture to get the perfect exposure with this one light setup and using the beauty of my smartphone over here and my that allows me to do a solo shoot. Let's go ahead and do that. So that was a really nice result. Let's go ahead and uh, put on this honeycomb pattern and it's supposed to reduce spill light, so let's see what kind of effect it actually has. So you see that's very interesting, the honeycomb completely kicks off any light from hitting the backdrop. So that's a great way to control that if you want to do other things with your backdrop. It also has a diffuser sock, which always makes light less harsh if your face is oily, tends to make the oils on your face not glow so much. So let's try this out with the honeycomb as well. And the characteristic that I would really describe to that diffuser, it just makes the light more pleasing, just a little bit softer, a little bit less harsh. And um, they say the bigger the light diffuser, the more pleasant it is. So if I had a 40 beauty dish or a, you know, a massive five foot octabox, that would 
even make it more pleasant. And thank you so much for tuning in. Check the description below if you want to figure out where to purchase any of these products. And I'll see you soon.